Uh, breaking news is in Yuba County tonight. A fire destroyed a semi truck and a trailer repair shop tonight. Fire caused evacuations in the area, but thankfully no homes are damaged. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Ty Steele and I'm Andrea Flores. This happened on Arboga Road near Malady Road. It's next to the Yuba County Airport. Yeah, KCRA 3's Andres Valle is joining us live in Olivehurst where the fire first broke out. Andres, what's it looking like right now? Well, crews are still on the scene monitoring what's left of that fire. Let me step away and show you exactly what we're seeing. Uh, they just finished aerial attacks, but way back there is what where is where the fire did start. It was the garage of this uh, truck repair shop, and we saw fire crews kind of observing the area. You can also see the parking lot sort of flooded. Uh, but here's some video that we shot earlier uh, tonight when we first arrived, when crews were still hosing down the fire. According to the fire chief, the building where the fire started was around 20 to 25,000 square feet which is now a total loss for the business. He tells us the fire at one point started moving to the rear of the property and crossed the railroad tracks, prompting evacuation orders to nearby homes. Here's what we know about how the fire could have started. Repair guys and mechanics were here, said they were working on a vehicle inside. They stepped out, came back in with the vehicle fully involved inside. There was multiple uh, vehicles in there with uh, multiple points of ignition. I just seen a lot of black smoke and a lot of flames. And so we just stood out there and we started hearing, um, I would assume propane tanks or I don't know, just explosions. And so then we heard the fire department and so we just stood there and watched. Now the fire chiefs now, the fire chief says that Arboga Road will be closed throughout the rest of the night. Uh, now, we also know that no other structures were damaged uh, here, but of course, uh, the cause of the fire is still under investigation. Live in Olivehurst, I'm Andres Vaya for KSRA 3 News. What a scary situation. Andres, thank you.